Do you know that farming is the main occupation of many people in our country? In India, farmers mainly depend on rainfall for growing crops. But the distribution of rainfall varies from one region to another. Farmers face a challenge while growing crops as they need a constant supply of fresh water. Thus, fresh water is supplied to the fields through the process of irrigation. The practice of supplying water to an area of land through pipes or channels for growing crops is known as irrigation. Tube wells, sprinklers and canals are some methods of irrigation that most farmers in India use. Let us know more about them. Tube wells are used to supply underground water to fields. Tube wells are dug in places where water is found deep below the earth's surface. The underground water is brought to the surface with the help of a pump. Sprinkler irrigation is another method of supplying water to the fields. It is done with the help of a device which is attached to pipes. A pump is used to force the water out of the pipes. Sprinklers distribute water on the fields like natural rainfall. A canal is a long and slightly narrow passage that is dug in the ground to carry water to the fields. Canals get water from rivers. Some canals also receive water from the reservoirs of dams. Dams are built across a river in order to prevent the water from flowing. The river water is stored in a reservoir behind the dam. The water stored in the reservoir is then taken to the fields through canals. Dams are useful to us in many ways. They are used to generate hydroelectricity. They also hold the excess water flowing in the river and prevent floods. When dams serve more than one purpose, they are called multi-purpose projects. Have you seen any of these methods of irrigation used for watering fields?